I really have the most beautiful life. But in June 2016, I got a phone call that changed things for me a little bit. From the time I got the call to the surgery date was only three weeks, which was a little bit daunting. I didn't really have much time to think about it, but I found out later that in 2016, 1,500 Canadian women were diagnosed with cervical cancer. I decided pretty quickly that I was going to use this event to kickstart my life again. You know, I have I have all these amazing people and all this beauty in my life and I just wanted to use my diagnosis to uh, get other people to uh, get checked out and, and figure out their own health issues. And so I spent the entire summer finding all the most beautiful things to do and with the most beautiful people. And even though I had some trouble getting off the couch some days, I really, really had the most amazing, beautiful summer last year. And it was all because of cancer, which is weird. As soon as I got the go ahead to start doing stuff, I figured I'd better find something pretty amazing to do to inspire myself to get out there and get moving. And through Facebook, a friend of mine, Louise Green, had her team of people that were doing the Ride to Conquer Cancer. And I thought, wow, that's probably a pretty good goal. So a couple of months ago, with the help of some pretty amazing friends, I got a new bike and I got some gear and I got on it and I started going. I'd kind of forgotten how much fun it is to ride a bike and I'm having the best time doing this and meeting new people and raising money for a good cause. My goal is to raise more than the minimum of $2,500 but the real reason for this video is to bring awareness to cervical cancer and early detection without which I don't really know what would have happened. So at the end of this video, there's going to be a link, and if you would like to donate to my Ride to Conquer Cancer, I would greatly appreciate it. And just getting the word out there is so important. Thanks for watching. See you on the road.